I've been winning these battles, right? And they thought they had me. They had the idea that Ye was bullying, uh, what I think the term, the liberal term is uh, a body goes black woman. Now let's talk about Gabby and my good friend Lizzo. Lizzo works with my trainer, a friend of mine, Harley Pasternak, Harley, Harley Pasternak. When Lizzo loses 10 pounds and announces it, the bots, uh, that's a term for uh, people like, it's like telemarketer call, callers, right. like on Instagram, they attack her for losing weight because the media wants to put out a perception that being overweight is the new goal when it's actually unhealthy. Yes. Let's get aside the fact of whether it's fashion and vogue, which it's not, let's, let's just, or if someone thinks it's attractive, to each his own. It's actually clinically unhealthy. And for people to, to promote that, um, it's, a, it's demonic. You know, what, can I ask? Yeah. I've noticed this also. Yeah. Why do you think they would want to promote unhealthiness among the population? It's a genocide of the black race. They want to kill us in any way they can. Planned Parenthood was made by Margaret Sanger, a known eugenics with the KKK. And I believe that if we saw ourselves as more, if we saw ourselves as a people and not a race, then we would treat our people better. Like if you go to a Jewish person and you say a race, it's, it almost gets confusing. It'll cut you off quickly and say, we're not a race, we're a people. Well, our people are supposed to just say, say it loud, I'm black and I'm proud. Okay, well what about, do you own the land that you're living in? Do you own, 